Hello, I'm Rasim from Roscar Tech and today I'll be showing you how to create a Keystone Cat 5e jack. The first thing you're going to need is a pair of scissors, a wire stripper, a good punch down tool with a 110 blade, your Keystone Cat 5e jack, and the patch cable. First thing you're going to want to do is take your patch cord and cut about an inch and a half of the jacket away. Like so. Then you're going to want to remove that piece of fiber. I like to use my scissors. Cut it away. After you've done that, you're going to want to separate the pairs. I like to use my jacket to separate the pairs. Okay, so take the jacket and you push down until the pair is separated. It's a lot faster than using your fingers and it, put, and it puts less strain on your fingers. After you separated them, you're going to want to straighten them out. Like so. After you separate separate them out, you're going to want to take your keystone jack in the US most people use the T568B color code you can use the B or A doesn't really matter but I'll be doing I'll be showing you how to punch down the B you're going to take about an inch a quarter inch of the patch cable put it in the jack you're going to start off with white orange Put it, put, put it the cable in its place. Then orange. Then white blue. Then blue. You want to pull that down a bit. After you've done that, you're going to want to take your punch down tool and with the cutting side facing outward, you're going to want to punch down. Okay, you got one side done. Now for the other. You're going to need your white brown. Then your brown. Then your white green. Then your green. And again, you're going to want to punch down using your punch down tool. with the cutting blade facing outward. Now, finally, we're gonna take our jack and the plastic cover, and we're gonna pop it into place. And we're gonna take our keystone Face plate, and we're going to pop that into place. And that's it.